by the end of this video, you will be able to type whatever you like in here and the program will generate an audio recording of your voice saying what you typed. By the end of this video, you will be able to type whatever you like in here and the program will generate an audio recording of your voice saying what you typed. Let's try this. I'm gonna attach a speaker to it. So it's generating it now. So this would sound like, hi, my name is Lucien Liu. Let's see how it goes. Hi, my name is Lucien Liu. Oh, oh, oh. oh, 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 oh man, this is gonna be it. Do you want to play a game? Oh. Make sure to subscribe and ring the bell button for more educational and entertaining videos like this. So let's do the test here. This is what it sounds like when I say it. What's going on guys? This is Lucien Liu. I'm currently using an AI version of my voice to speak with you right now. All the audio is AI generated. I've only typed out the words for the AI to type. You can get this feature too with a program called Descript. I imagine this will save you a lot of time. Now this is the AI version. What's going on guys? This is Lucien Liu. I'm currently using an AI version of my voice to speak with you right now. All the audio is AI generated. I've only typed out the words for the AI to type. You can get this feature too with a program called Descript. I imagine this will save you a lot of time. So imagine the use case here being, I have a piano blog and channel here. Imagine if I had this, this all typed out on a script. Let's do this, so. How can I become better at sight reading? Any recommendations for books, exercises, videos? To get better at sight reading you must Read new music every day The new music you read every day should be slightly lower than your level So you can train your reaction and reading skills Learn to read the musical notation as if they were the signs on the road If you miss one, you must stop and correct yourself Your goal is to play with 100% accuracy in notes And 100% accuracy in rhythm On the first time you read it through here are some good resources with exercises to improve your sight reading. One journey opus to 199. Learn one new exercise per week. These start out easy, but get harder towards the end of the book. To for star sight reading series. I did all 10 books for 10 years of my piano career. These books give you one new exercise to play for each day of the week, as well as clapping rhythm exercises to develop your rhythm abilities. There are also ear training exercises for you to do at the end of each chapter. 3. Download your favorite sheet music. Sight reading ability also improves with how many pieces of music you have read and learned by reading sheet music. Naturally, the more pieces you learn from sheet music, the faster you get at sight reading. The more difficult the pieces you read, the easier most sheet music will become to you. YouTube is a good resource. Lots of creators upload their sheets onto musicnotes.com for purchase. I bought Bohemian Rhapsody by Jera Radnick here. Muse score is also good. I recently got MuseScore Pro and can find many arrangements made by users. For memorize the 30 most common notes. If you don't already have the notes memorized, I highly suggest using flashcards to memorize all 30 common notes. If you know 30 people, you can match 30 names to 30 faces. Then you can definitely memorize 30 notes on the grand staff. You can also get an app to test instant recognition of notes and rests, or you can play this game. 5. If you're tired of reading one note at a time, and dream of sight reading at to two four notes at a time, and you never had any formal training, here's a free course I made to help you review the basic fundamentals. Holy crap. Wow. I'm just impressed here, because it even got the breaths between the sentences. Like, Staff, you can also get an app to test instant recognition of notes and rests. Like, like, get that. Note at a time. And dream of the comma with the breath time and dream of sight reading of <laughs> and the program will generate an audio recording of your voice saying what you typed uh we'll find out because i haven't actually done it yet at this point so what we're gonna have to do here is actually open up a script that we're gonna have to read 
it may take up to 30 to 60 to 90 minutes. If you watch this video, it'll tell you about it to get all of this stuff done, right? And it might take a day to process, but uh, we are currently trialing it. We are going to test it out. And I'm going to try and read through this script with no interruptions here. Um, so try to have a glass of water right beside and uh, try not to choke. But if you make any mistakes, apparently you just keep going. So uh, make sure to have a good microphone, you know, so it's a nice and quiet place and we will get started. Here we go. So let's click on this recording button and we will start reading the script. So if you're doing this like me, make sure you don't make the mistake of clicking this record and thinking that it's recording because you have to press this record button to, to record. So don't make that same mistake. I'm lucky I also recorded this separately. <laughs> so I'm going to import that now. I, the owner of the voice you are listening to right now, give consent to Descript to create an overdub voice of this voice. Dorothy lived in the midst of the great Kansas prairies with Uncle Henry. There were only four witches in all the land of Oz, and two of them, those who live in the north and the south, are good witches. If anyone treads on my toes or sticks a pin into me, it doesn't matter, for I can't feel it. And this pleased me and made me feel that I was quite an important person. All right, so now it's transcribing up in here. I've just imported it. Make sure when you click this, you also click the other one. So uh, this is another way, I guess. It's quite fast. 63% already, 65, 67 of the entire uh, 30 minutes. All right, so we gotta let the file upload complete. So we can listen to it. I, the owner of the voice you are listening to right now. Sounds great. Okay, let's submit it. Sweet, show you what happens after. So we just got the overdub feature. Let's try this. I'm gonna attach a speaker to it. So it's generating it now. So this would sound like, hi, my name is Lucien Lu. Let's see how it goes. Hi, my name is Lucien Lu. <laughs> Thank you for watching this video. If you'd like to download and play around with Descript for your podcast or entertainment purposes, check the link in the description below. I have a pro plan with Descript. I am not affiliated with Descript, although I'd love to be. Descript has been amazing for transcribing text to speech. I have been using it to transcribe audio into text. But now that we have overdub, we can transcribe text to audio. I no longer have to spend as much time correcting all my flubs and mistakes in post. I hope to use this program to pump out all kinds of content and value so I can focus on doing what I love the most, teaching, inspiring, and entertaining audiences. I hope you had a great time watching this video and that you will use this technology to further advance the human race. With great power comes great responsibility. Please like, share, and subscribe. Tell me in the comments what you will be using your Descript powers for. I'm very curious about how the future will be with technology like this being accessible to everyone with a computer, maybe even a phone. Make sure to subscribe and ring the bell button for more educational and entertaining videos like this. Have a great day, stay healthy, and I'll see you in the next one. For our top comment of the week from our last video, Klaus says, What do you gain from having 100k followers on TikTok? Do you get a prize, award, or some kind of monetary gain? I don't use TikTok so I have no idea about the app. No, it's like any other social platform. We build them to understand our audiences and build relationships with them. As mentioned in the video, the more people you entertain or educate, the more people will subscribe to see more of your content. The more people you have subscribed gives you a larger sample size to make better content, products, or value for that audience. Everyone's different. My goal is to build brand awareness around what I like to do in hopes of inspiring and educating people about piano and filmmaking. To read the full comment, go watch the previous video where I show you how I grew to more than 100,000 followers on TikTok. My name is Lucien Liu, and I'll see you next time.